Thanks, Bridget. Law enforcement agencies throughout Southeast Wisconsin are alarmed by the spread of dangerous drug use among young people. Oftentimes, parents are the most surprised of anyone when their children end up in trouble. And the YMCA at Paps Farms out in Oconomowoc has a week's worth of activities coming up to educate young people and their parents about what is happening on this front. Amber Joyce is with us now. She's the Youth Development Co uh, Director there. Amber, thanks for coming. Thanks, um, let's first talk about the fact that I think when people hear uh, you're having some sort of drug summit in Oconomowoc, well, there's not a drug problem in Oconomowoc. People are always surprised that these things are happening in the suburbs, in their communities. Oh, yeah. There's uh, actually in the month of May, we had seven deaths alone um, in Oconomowoc from heroin overdoses. So the problem is definitely escalating there. And then when you look at kind of the similar thing, inside families, many parents certainly believe, well, that is a problem for some families, but it couldn't possibly be something uh, in, in my family. And unfortunately, many parents are, are caught by surprise. Yeah, unfortunately, a lot of the stories we hear are of parents saying, I never thought my child would do such things. And those are the ones that are most at risk because the parents don't get involved and educated. Mm -hmm. So that's part of what you're doing this uh, next week, actually, uh, yes, is the next programs, week. but you want people to sign up today. Um, tell us about, uh, about the week that you have planned for families. So on Monday, we will be having an education class for adults and for children, middle school and up. Um, it's about a two-hour program in the evening, and just kind of going through, like, if my friend's using, what do I do for the mm -hmm. kids? And then for parents, if my kid's using, what do I do? Or what are the warning signs that I need to look for? Mm -hmm. And then you do want people to sign up ahead of time for, for some of these things. Tell me what, what they need to do. Yep. Uh, for the Monday class, we just want to kind of get a head count. So if mm -hmm. you could just call the Y and uh, sign up at, through our member services desk. It is a free program, so mm -hmm. no charge or anything. We just want to get a head count. And then a big event uh, coming up to sort of culminate at the end of the week as well. And I understand you have experts there and other people that can interact directly. Yeah. So on Saturday, we have an event uh, starting at 4 o'clock. And we've actually partnered with Rogers Memorial Hospital, Rosecrans, a couple local counseling agencies. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Fun Rentals is providing a big inflatable obstacle course Gotta have and that. Uh, we'll be doing a little speaker and some fun things with the kids. All right, Amber, thanks so much for sharing that and thanks good luck with me. the program. We have more information up on our website, tmj4.com.